July 4th. I got a call at the shop this morning from uh, an old friend, Brian Schmidt. He said that he was out at this lake bass fishing yesterday. Caught some bass, but saw some really big catfish kind of cruising in close along the rocks over on the other side. So we closed up the shop about midday, and I met him down here at this lake. We're going to try to get some of these some of these catfish he's been seeing. Good thing about Brian, good thing about fishing with him, he works for Uncle Feather Merchants, and he always has plenty of flies with him. So he brought some meat whistles and some backstabbers, stuff that we usually accidentally catch catfish on, some smaller ones, accidentally when we're, when we're bass fishing or carp fishing. See if they do the trick. Nice bass Brian pulled out of the weeds there. Get another one then. Yeah, what'd you get him on? A uh, black meat whistle. A black meat whistle? Big fish, man. This this guy this guy took a lot to eat. See if you can get him to croak for you. <laughs> nice. Mark another species for the backstabber. Yeah, he's off. <laughs> Ooh, that's a hog. <laughs> Smitty's got himself another big catfish. gear hanging out of his mouth. <laughs> Somebody fed him a worm. Oh, and he's got more gear now. <laughs> Another meat whistle cat. Fun stuff, man. But look at that cat right there. Look how gray he is in comparison. You see him? <laughs> <laughs> 